What's up, what's up, what's up, what's up? Bah, it's your boy, DC Too Cool, back again for another video. What's happening, everybody? What's popping? What's good? Today, we're talking about the last transformation for the boos, the Majin Race in Dragon Ball Universe 2. News, speculation, you know what it is. Let's get into it. So, uh, everyone knows Boo Han. Huh? Everybody knows Boo Tinks and everything, you know. Go on Absorb, Go Tinks Absorb. You know, slash Piccolo. Obviously, that's what happened in anime, right? So, once again, uh, going along with what I said earlier in the last video, um, and what I said about the Saiyans, they will not make up transformations. I do not see them making up transformations for, for characters that already have transformations in place. So, to reiterate again, Saiyans have Super Saiyan transformations and God transformations, and... The Majins have absorption transformations and kid transformations. So that is what I see them going with for characters who already have pre transformations. It only makes sense then to create an original transformation for Majins that didn't exist. So, with Majins or Super Boos, uh, which I believe would be the second transformation, and then they will go into the absorption phase like you did in the anime. The question is though, how will this feature work? Um, will it be you absorb uh, a character, you know, who are, who you're actually facing against? So I'm, I'm pretty sure that's impossible. I mean, well, it's not impossible, but that'd be like automatic KO, and you know, it, it just be. I don't think I, I don't see how that could happen. Like, it just wouldn't make sense. I mean, virtually, Super Boo when he absorbs people, he just usually gets their clothing material, uh, or you know, well, I, I guess it could be, you know pieces of them in general yes she does have them stored inside him so I guess you know actually having like you know freezes parts on him or sells parts on him wouldn't be out of the question um you know and then he'll probably just have their some of their attacks and uh stat boost you know uh defense boost and attack boost you know I don't think that would be that hard to do especially if you're customizing the game or you know to have people be able to use all these kinds of different clothing stuff for people on these characters anyway. Uh, I don't see why you maybe couldn't just do that for the boos, you know, let them absorb. I think virtually it's going to be basically you just basically you won't actually see no absorption technique. It will just say like a quick power up, like oh, he absorbs such and such, or like absorb, freeze absorb, cell absorb, you know, 16 absorb. You have a piece of their clothing or something, and then you get some of their attacks, and you know. And that pretty much might get the ultimate, might get one of the super attacks and keep the ones you already have. I think that's kind of the way it will work. I don't think it's going to be some super in-depth, over-the-top system. But that's it for me on the matter. What you guys think? Like, subscribe. Until the next video, catch you guys later. Peace.